Everything here is digital, high tech. Yeah, we have the cameras, the flat screen TVs, even this watch here that I'm going to show you a little bit later. But you know what, John? This story is for you because it's about a hundred ways to pimp your ride. Welcome back to Consumer Watch Extra. I'm Sue Kwan. Retailers have long relied on coupons and discounts to lure in reluctant shoppers. And now there's a new way to get a good deal. It all depends on the number of people willing to sign up. The Indiana Jones saga is 27 years old. So the challenge for filmmakers was to keep that authentic look for the older viewers while employing modern technology. These are all headsets from Plantronics. This one is actually from Palm. It actually sits and gets charged right there inside of your lighter. And then you have this. It's called the Jawbone. And I'll tell you why this is called the Noise Assassin after this story. Let's go ahead and take a look at the map with all of our testees positioned around the Bay Area. We have Teresa Silva in San Jose, Juliet Goodrich in Dublin, viewer Ron Puccinelli is in Concord, and we also have CBS 5 writer Ryan McKeel who's standing outside of his house in Noe Valley in San Francisco. Now when I say go, you guys, you're going to email Brittany a photograph. Take that picture maybe of your photographer. Are you ready? Set go. And now Brittany, who does have a connection to the AT&T 3G networks, waiting for that email, that photo to arrive. Now, at the end of the story, in a little less than two minutes, we'll see how many have made it through the network and to Brittany's iPhone. Yes, welcome to IMVU. It's a virtual world where I did what I couldn't do in real life. I created this avatar. It's an online fantasy version of myself, fantasy. Okay, first of all, there's, from what I'm told, there's never been a, a study, a human study, tracking the consumption of albacore tuna in cans with uh, and measuring the levels of mercury, so I decided to do an unscientific experiment. I ate 25 ounce cans of canned albacore over 20 days and did not eat any other seafood, didn't want to contaminate my results, and here's what happened. There's plenty of power, lots of affordable land, and what Google calls a suitable workforce to run this mammoth technology facility. But Google is not just looking for computer experts. Much like whole industries have been created around the iPhone and the iPod, the iPad will bring lots of money-making opportunities for people who create applications, media content, and books. Several people contacted CBS 5 with similar stories, accusing Global Air of changing changing carriers, opening extra lines, or ordering new phones without their permission, sticking customers with the bills. And when they complain, they say Global Air gave them the runaround. Here online at google.com slash phone, I can click on purchase now, and then you have these different options here. $530 for the Nexus One phone unlock basically means you can take the card out of a phone, for example, an iPhone, and put it in and use the, that service, for example, the AT&T service. So it's a lot to pay for an unlocked phone, and time will tell if uh, consumers are that anxious to get it. Now, at this unveiling, I've never seen anything like it. We had General Colin Powell, Governor Schwarzenegger, executive from Walmart and Google, all there to hear a Silicon Valley scientist who literally wants to change the world. The core of our technology simply is sand. Seeing what it's like to live on $4 a day worth of food stamps, it used to be $3, right. right? The economic stimulus plan bumped that up to $4 a person per day. I'm on day number four. I'm going to show you some of the things that I've been eating. And, you know, I've been getting so much feedback, emails and comments on our Eye on the Blogs page with people suggesting where to shop, what to buy, what to eat. Bottom line, though, it has not been easy, and it's not easy, especially for food stamp recipients who are experienced at the daily challenge of eating on $4 a day. Two weeks later, I did mark myself with a Sharpie everywhere and re-measured. I'm still the same as I was when I left the salon. And uh, Michelle says that things like soda, processed food, alcohol will make those inches come back faster. So in the end, if I want to feel thinner for a big event or something, I may pay $120 because it feels right. But really Really, for the extended periods where you think you want to lose weight for eternity, <laughs> you really do have to exercise and eat well. You can't just wrap it away every week. <laughs> <laughs> Save that videotape for your, your real Yeah, there, Lost Sue. Inches and Pride, but yeah. hey. <laughs> well, you know, men are normally just happy if their underwear is clean. You know, you got tidy whities you have boxers, but now we have this. Ecumen, high-performance underwear for men. And on Consumer Watch, we put it to the test. Body 
taming undergarments are a mainstay for many figure-conscious women. It's your scuba suit. We hide away, lift up, squish down, and apparently men are starting to go through the same motions in Australia, in Europe, and now in the U.S. This crosses the upper back, crosses the lower back to help core stability, core strength, and smooth away the love handles and muffin top. Corey Chung introduces Ecumen, performance shapewear for dudes. Men are objectified just as much as women are, and you know, once you hit 30, your body starts to decline. You don't really have time to go to the gym, but yeah, you do want to look like Brad Pitt. You know, and then we have to set up that meeting. Don Seurat, the busy salesman, pats his problem area, the top half, Good luck. and welcomes the chance to try the goods along with two other daring product testers. <laughs> they wrestled and twisted their way into the unmentionables, All right. and with some careful editing, we unveil the results. Not bad. His waist, about an inch less overhang. And the chest? I feel that my man boobs are totally under control now. <laughs> what do you think about the booty? Does he feel it being pulled up? Yeah, but you know, I have a great booty to begin with, so it's no problem. But how does it give extra definition to the derriere? It's cupping this area. It's pushing up, you know, giving you a little quarterback rear end. Wow, you don't need this. What videographer Daniel Murphy needs is a girlfriend, and that's why he's showing off the skivvies. He knew they'd look good, but was surprised by the other features. I feel everything just like ties into the middle. Here's why he's feeling uplifted. The seam here is placed an extra centimeter back mm. so that it has a lifting and enhancing oh, effect. I can't say anything to that. <laughs> and the secret to feeling cool in the right places? It has some extra holes so to keep the airflow going. And finally, Gary Schick, our active tool guy, faced the same challenge the others had. Getting the shirt on was a little, you know, I, I was afraid I was going to rip it. But as soon as it went on, it's like I felt my whole body just kind of, whoo, that was fun. My back just feels like there's a weight was taken off. He is really feeling the back and core support and... No boobs. This ain't your grandpa's underwear. This is made from high-performance fabric designed for athletes, but men are paying the price to look good in the right places. And at 80 to $120 per piece, Ecumen wasn't for everyone. Not for $80. In that case, I'd want someone to see me. <clears throat> but not everyone wants that awkward moment of truth. Showtime. It would actually be kind of nice to know that they have to go through some of the things that we have to go through. Help. <laughs> <laughs> so the disclosure is that you might need some help getting them off Well, Murphy's there. in shape, too. Look at this. Yeah. Tight, tight. And they're sold at Saks and online. That's expensive. Right? No subject is taboo. If you have questions, you can call. I know you had a question, but I think a little yeah, mystery. You know, I no. did want to ask. You want these boxers or briefs? A, a little mystery <laughs> is, is a good thing. But if a guy is given this as a Valentine's Day gift this year. It's a valuable that's gift. That's a yeah. not-so-subtle hint. Yeah. So. Well, and it's, it's expensive, so they should appreciate it. Better get her flowers, guys. All right, uh, let's go to weather.